Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Uh, we're going to be continuing with Terraria today. With a lot of branching paths here. From where I left off last time. So, I think I'm going to go the way which I started to explore. See if there is anything down here. Oh, there's a cave back down that way. Down there, which I just saw. But, I'm not entirely sure if that's the best way to go. Alright, that just seems to like link around to the top one. Which, of course, is... not connected to anything. Get some more silver ore. Alright, and I guess the last place to go is... Well, I could go up, but going up isn't going to... Really get me anything. Although it could. I guess it's always best to go up before I go venturing down. What's that money? Oh, of course. Oh, just a massive puddle of water which I can just flood down. Which would just be amazing right now. Okay, right, I can't quite reach that. Falling to my death again seems nice, apart from when you have a bunch of ropes. There's a thing down here. A mini boss flying. Of course, from all the baby slimes. Right, I'm just going to throw one of those down. What is that? One of those over that way. Right, the place seems safe enough, seeing as it has water in it. Oh, there's a big area down there with light. Oh, mushrooms. Right, this looks like it leads down to there. So I'm just going to explore. Wow, I just survived another boulder fall without even realizing it was there. Right, this way seems pretty much like a dead end. Apart from it has a lot of silver ore. Right, I'm just going to grab a bunch of it and then get back out. Because there is a lot here. But I don't want to get to that moment where I'm like, I remember being with loads of silver ore, and then I come to a part where I need a bunch. But I could have easily just taken enough then. So I'll take Camplum out, but I won't spend too much time on it. Oh, a mother slime. Oh, another heart. That's nice. See, it's moments like this when you know that you're digging to somewhere. So you want to get there faster. Although I do not want the water to come with me. 
And neither do I want the mother slime. Well, I just love the music in this game. Gotta go with one more again, just as the water. Alright, um. Down here. Seems logical. Oh, well. This should be fun. Looks like we've finally got ourselves a skeleton. And another heart. And a very big area to explore. Life crystal. Right. It's going to be this moment where I'm going to have to get rid of some useless things. Right, most of this stuff is useless, but I'll leave it there for now, just because I have no reason to get rid of it. Right, there we go, 160. I can take these things on. No bombs from that one. Okay. Whoa. I need to remember how dangerous it can be down here. I need to remember how to actually live and not die. Danger sense potion could be useful, I guess. No, that it's also very useful for the dungeon when there's spikes everywhere. Okay, there's a lot of enemies there. I'm going to have to think this one through. Alright, what do we have? Mushrooms for hell. Shalukans. Alright, that seems good enough. I guess that was a good enough way to get them to fall into a hole. A hole which I really do not want to go into. There's more enemies. What is that? Right, there we go. It just fell onto something. I couldn't care what it was. I just hopefully it was an enemy. Didn't mean to use a shortcut on that. Is that a switch? Or is it a trick? I don't know, it looks like a switch. Oh, it's a sapphire. Of course. That, that definitely looks like a sapphire. It's 
so many enemies, but just nothing down there worth getting. Let's have a look on the map. It seems like the most logical way to go. I guess. Trying to reach me as soon as I killed it. Back to the blinding. I mean, of course, there'd be stuff down here. I mean, just look at the place. Probably should have gone the way that wouldn't end up using all my. Wait, is the water flow different? I think it might be. It looks slightly different. Over here, I'm thinking down. I need an extractor for all this silt. It is called silt, isn't it? Oh, yeah, silt. There is definitely a lot of stuff down there. The only problem is, it looks like it's a lot of water. I could do with a better pickaxe, to be honest. This one isn't doing any wonders. Could be a problem. Thing as there is definitely a chest down there, but there is not really any way to breathe. Unless I make that away. Oh, not right now. I wonder if I'm going to be able to drain all the water. I think I will be able to actually. Oh, I'll have a nice little bomb. All I need to do is just get this to go down there. We'll drain the water, but it won't take that other water. And it looks like there's another spider's nest over there. Which isn't great. Flippers. Accessories. Now I can swim. That helps a lot. 
gold healing some new heals uh, more glow sticks and a water walking potion all of those because I am right now underwater of course Well, I have to see how good I am at taking on these spiders, won't I? Before I can actually go down the other way. Good enough, I guess. It just takes a long time for them to die. This is a lot of cobwebs. Where did the other one go? I wonder. I'll lay down there into the abyss. The good thing about glow sticks as well is that you can move them by breaking what's beneath them. Guess over there will be fun to explore. Oh, Humphrey. He's the merchant, not the travelling merchant, so I guess that means he's moved into the house, or will be. Oh, of course, that's where the other spider went. Gonna get its AI stuck. Congrats, spider. I'm going in the exact same way that I need to go. Just gonna drop down onto me now. Or not. Ow! And for some reason, every time I hear that, I somehow think of the Wilhelm scream. That? Why is there so many spiders down there? Flooded as well, which is a bit strange. Unless this whole area below me is part of a spider's nest, and because it was flooded, this just all moved into the thing. It's possible. Nurses arrived as well. Nurses are pretty boring. No, you don't. I'm way ahead of you. Looks like we've got a lot to face. Likely. Yep, that was so close. 
Well, I had to die, otherwise, when I respawned, I'd be in the middle of nowhere. And I wouldn't be in that hole anymore. But anyway, thanks for watching. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks in advance. And I'll speak to you all next time.